hello guys welcome to our 14th lecture of tutorial for beginners and this lecture we will learn how we will divide the uh, quantity by its color or you can say how we can divide the uh, quantity by its category it is very important uh, function and it is very useful tool by using just only the sum formula and please watch the full video it is very uh, helpful for everyone to understand and very helpful for everyone to just use the sum formula with some unique function in it so first I just uh, you write the subject line which is subtotal by color and again I just write the formula bold and and he just make it color now I just write the uh, color and in color I write red blue green I can blue or uh, green and blue and the last one is red here I write the quantity in quantity I write 10 20, 25, 30, 25, 30, 20, 30, and the last one is 10. And in amount section, I just write here 150, 340, 350, um, 510, 280, 510, and the last one is 150. I just select all the boxes, and as I uh, do again middle and alignment and same border box thick border box you have just click it on bold and again I just zoom in so it will be helpful to understand how you work and and just color the whole function so that you can now I just uh, write here a dollars so you just know how to use a dollar function we will just make it dollar and here I write the same color and total and in color I just use red which will be category taken red blue and the last one is green and here I just write the uh, total and you just uh, Tick border box and tick box and again you have to just make here the tick border box and just have to color the box to give some importance here you see how we can use we just use the dollar figures here so we will just select all the boxes and write dollar here so it will give values in dollar so how we will uh, use the sum function we will use equals to sum and sum if now it says range which range you want we, we want this range uh, comma and this range selecting this range you have to just select the whole range now comma before uh, Proceeding further, you have to just write a dollar sign which will make the cells constant so it will not, uh, you know, be uh, shuffling by uh, putting any formula in it. So I just put the dollar sign so to make it constant. Now I just write which value or which uh, color it should see. So I just write here the address of this cell E. Eight, which means it should see red color and select the red color from here and now which amount now it says some ranges so here are the sum ranges so we just give the same range and in the same range we will again use the dollar sign to make it a uh, constant uh, here and just right here you see 300 it means the red total red one 150 and second one uh, 
red is 150 so the total combining 150 and 150 becomes 300 so in this sense it will automatically ca calculate all the red things in it now you just have to drag it down so it will automatically create and it will automatically uh, select the blue function if I just uh, increase the uh, red by just decreasing the, the blue it will automatically give the value to it this is how the uh, subtotal by color or you can also write the subtotal by uh, something else like cars and uh, some uh, products and some for some function you just have to use the simple uh, very basic formula which is the total of the three and you have to just bracket close and here you see how the total works you can use this subtotal function this is very important tool i just write here the uh, formula so that it will be helpful for everyone to understand how uh, the formula works i just copy it and apostrophe and then paste it i just use the uh, merge and center function bold and italics here how the sum function works this is how our subtotal by color function use and if you like our video please share and subscribe it and if you face any confusion you can write in our com comment section our team will surely reply you thanks so much